Well, of course, it is that time of year again, so a bunch of kids heading back to school today. That's right. MTN's Emma Hamilton has more on what's going on in the Bozeman School District this year. The school district looks forward to this time every year. This is a really uh, great time of year for us. Um, most all of us that are in education, we're in, we're in the education because, you know, because we love kids and we want to be around kids and help them learn and, and grow. And so when we have an opportunity to welcome kids back into our schools, it's always really exciting. Many exciting things happened over the summer within the district to get ready for this school year. We welcomed a number of new staff members to our district. We probably had 30 to 40 new staff members. Some of those are replacements for folks that retired. Some of them are for teachers that took a leave of absence for a year or whatever. Um, and some of them are, you know, just brand new staff members because we have a growing school district. A part of hiring new staff, two new elementary school principals were also hired. Something new for the district this year is having seat belts on the school buses. Soon, the district will have to start discussing the boundaries for the new high school. It's a great community discussion. It's not easy when you start talking about school boundaries, but um, it's an uh, opportunity for our community to get engaged in the discussion and talk about um, you know, what's important to them and, and uh, which neighborhoods go to which schools and those sorts of things and how we, how we determine boundaries to make sure that they're fair and equitable. And in Bozeman, Emma Hamilton, MTN News. The Bozeman Police Department is hosting its